Welcome back to Fun Media, everybody. And I had a super good question, and it was about export. Someone new to YouTube said, Hey, I want to make a video to YouTube. There's tons of export on Pinnacle Studio, all versions. This one is 24 Ultimate. Uh, which one is the best one? So I'm going to show you actually a tutorial on not all of them, all right, but pretty much all those that are mostly used on the, the export format all right so just to show you a bit of to understand more about the export I got this very small video right here which is like a, a title a transition and an ending it's about one minute all right so you can understand all the files you're gonna see are gonna be compared to a one minute video all right let's go into the export all right format so uh, of course once you've choose your destination right here you put your name today we're going to talk most likely about this thing right here the format so um the first one i'm going to show you is the first one if you click format here that will appear on top h264 okay h so i'm not going to go to all of these but most of those that are being used all right is anyway i'll just continue so um hd uh, 1080 is pretty much the minimum today in 2021 that you want for quality of course there is a lot more quality right here but you know just make sure you keep it keep it in both hg at least hd 720 uh this one's not the one for you too all right so 169 meg for one minute video in h264 h264 you you're gonna keep a good quality of your video but you're gonna have a smaller size of uh, file and this one would be mostly used for blu-ray all right so if you're lucky enough to have a blu-ray burner well this one would be your choice for the blu-ray all right um so but you're gonna lose a bit of a you're gonna keep pretty much all the quality but you're gonna lose a bit of file format if you don't care about file format all right that you don't really need it then you're gonna go with AVEC I'm gonna put it to full HD let's see a full uh, screen DV it went up a little bit so uh, AV is a little bit like uh, the first one right here but with this one you won't track you will not sacrifice a lot of quality you're gonna keep the quality of your initial video but this one's gonna you won't sacrifice uh, a lot of uh, file size so AVE if you want to share uh, if you want to send a video or you want to put it on the uh, just read it on your computer if you want to put it on a uh, shirt to a friend on a USB big USB key or you want you have a another hard drive and you want to bring into your office and to make a presentation this one is pretty good all right uh, the third one I'm gonna show you is gonna be real quick all right um, it's gonna be this one quick time all right still in 1080 this one is almost uh, 7 meg it's it's really 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 high um it's gonna be used most for stuff like they they call it an alpha channel i'm not gonna make a tutorial on alpha channel right now but if you know what is alpha channel and that's what you you, you need the video for that uh quick time movie even if it's a strong file would be good for that uh, next one one of the most popular all right um, right here mpeg4 so 1080 once again uh, the file is lower than uh, the quick time we've just seen but it's a little higher than other that we've seen if you want to share on YouTube all right and for the question that I had this one is the answer if you're making stuff for YouTube you want to make sure it's high quality enough but not like this strong super super strong file for one minute uh if you really don't care you, you really need the quality make make sure it's 80 
uh, HD 1080 MPEG 4 for one minute is pretty high for the size you will not sacrifice a lot of quality if you go 720 see it's still HD but see this one's gonna go down a lot for one minute I don't really care but if it's a strong 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 like long movie maybe you want to go uh, HD 720 the quality is gonna be pretty high anyway see here it's gonna drop 85 so if you have a video that is 30 minutes well you won't be above one jig but if you go a full HD like that of course this one's gonna do it's gonna be a lot more longer longer to transfer but anyway MPEG 4 whichever you choose is good for YouTube Facebook Instagram you know all of those of course if you really need the, sm the file to be small you could go like to very small file like that full size HD good quality it's only 14 megas this is very very small but there then with that you will lose uh, quality of course it's you, you can watch it uh, you know people that are doing um, movie using torrent you know or stuff like that or streaming like kind of illegal stuff on on the internet they you know sometimes they need to to put the size down depending of because they will propose high quality small quality sometimes people just want to download a uh, small file so but if you want to get this the, the file smaller there's something else and yet that the MPEG 4 that you might want to use and I will show you that later but right now if we're talking about YouTube Facebook Instagram Twitter all of those you know just make sure you choose MPEG 4 that's the one that is perfect uh, the next one another MPEG is MPEG 2 right so MPEG 2 will be used for DVDs all right so not not the blu-ray but more like DVDs MPEG 2 is gonna be an easy one for that uh, next one uh, now flash let's go talk about flash flash video right here see this one went down it's it's going down I mean if you're doing uh, streaming website or just a video like you have a website about anything just talking about your own stuff and everything you want to make sure you're you don't have a lot of uh, space you know to uh, your host doesn't give you a lot of space on your website you want to save uh, some files because you don't want to pay more money because your website is already uh, all jam-packed I mean just make that one flash video yes you're gonna lose a bit of quality but it's gonna be good enough for like a specific website talking about your own stuff you know it's would be the right choice uh, of course if you're doing like Pinnacle Studio is not the perfect one if you're doing audio only stuff right? it's a video editing program but you have the possibility I mean to do some audio stuff and if you want to just do audio well you just select that all right audio only and then it, it's gonna disregard about the video and if you want to make sure you have something good I, I would suggest you mp3 best quality all right so for one minute when you download a song online normally it's a couple of meg this one is one minute normally song, songs are a bit longer than that but mpeg3 best quality audio only if you're doing a song only or music or a podcast maybe that would be a good choice uh, so next one I'm, I want to show you this one here Windows Media all right Windows Media the good thing is see HD 1080 it's a very 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 small file so if you really need to sacrifice uh, f the size of your file and want to keep it as more as possible 1080 so here's the thing of yes it's pretty small and you believe hey man this is a small file for 1080 but honestly if you really really have a good eye it's 1080 but you're losing a bit of quality but uh let, let's say you want to share a, f a f file keeping a good quality you want to share it on messenger to all of your friends but make sure your video is still a good quality well that one would be a good choice 
like we've seen before you can have a sm file small like that using mpeg4 all right mpeg4 and just going with small files all right that's very 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 small we'll see 14 meg 14 34 megs pretty much the same thing i would prefer going if i want a really small file i would prefer going with windows media and choose 1080 it's going to be a small file it's going to be a little better quality not like a real real 1080 file but it's going to be not too bad all right so if we look here uh it's pretty much the best one of course there's more like cineform i mean look at that just for one minute 172 j i mean we're not editing to bring this movie to the movie theater and need like the super big quality because it could be a giant 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 screen but i mean there's a couple of more options that you can choose right here uh something else like the button here you can work like format right now we're working with choose the format all right uh, you also have extension which is a bit like format you're just gonna choose first the extension let's say you're making a contract and the person giving you a contract say make sure it's mpeg4 well you can go like here or format here it doesn't really matter but then you have all the sub you know sub stuff it's just basically the same thing i mean extension or format you're gonna have mpeg4 or all of those anyway movie or a gif if you want to do a little gif for your phone you know when you text sometimes you go with a gif you could do it here's extension gif it's going to be an animation of course very very small file i mean not maybe even that one but that one for one minute one minute's a bit long for a gift but f normally gift might be five second ten second it would be just very very small so if you want to do a gif i mean why not can do it like that and device i mean if you have a contract let's say you work for apple well you have all the apple stuff right here that's really good you're making a video for something really really specific or device you're working maybe for xbox making a video for xbox one right then there you go you have everything that needs to be done with uh with xbox sony playstation the nintendo Wii maybe i mean all the kind of video that those uh, game are using might be might be fine right here might be found right here in the device and choose a device and after that you just click start export and one time out of 1000 it might crash i mean it's like i said one time out of a thousand every time I'm done with my export. It's gonna appear like, okay, export done, go to file. What I'm gonna do is click on my file, open it, and make sure everything is working fine. I mean, just to make sure. It might happen never, but just make sure that everything is perfect. Because after that, if you just grab your project to the garbage and you, then you look at your file, it's there's a little mistake in it, then you're screwed so that's it so i hope you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe it's always uh, uh thanks for all uh, for uh, us and i'll be talking to you next time with fun media see you guys